Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. It's Expresso here on SABC3. Man, I'm smiling from cheek to cheek. We have an interesting show for you. Now, we all know that it's difficult to make it onto any sexiest list, but we have three of the top 12 hottest tongues in the land here with us. We've got Anton, we've got Shane, and we've got Seven. They, of course, are part of Cosmo's Sexiest Men calendar, which was released last month. And the beautiful Kim, who's not in the calendar, but not we're, not we're appreciating year. what's before us. Guys, good morning. Welcome to Express. Good morning. Oh, this is fantastic. Okay, so, so I'm going to start off with you. We just chatted about um, health and diapers with Dr. Darren Green now. You guys need to look extremely good when it comes to this calendar. How do you do it? How do you keep in shape? How do you make sure that your abs are just like on point? I have to be honest, Tosa genetics help a lot. Does it? Uh, Tosa <laughs> genetics are a huge, the, we call it the factor, that, the X factor. Okay. The, Factor. Uh, as you can see, these guys are better looking. I'm just the personality, and I gotta be funny. <laughs> gotta be funny. I'm gonna be very funny to okay. compete with these people. No, 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 uh, no, no. Very no, no, funny. He, I don't believe you. Right now, we've got a picture of Siv up on your screen, and as you can see, he doesn't have a six pack. He's got a ten pack. It's a, an so eight. So stop lying. Getting, getting to ten. Oh, getting it's getting to, to, 10. 10. Getting to ten. Getting to ten. It's getting to ten. Kim, I know you've got a question for the guys as well. Uh, do you <laughs> men feel objectified, women looking at you in these? Calendars. <laughs> and do you Swap mind? <laughs> I had to be honest, when I'm on the flight and someone lifts up my shirt, then yes. Yeah. Oh, they get no, a little I'm pinch sorry. in the ass. Yeah. Yeah. Can I say yes? Yeah. I want to apologize. Really? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I want to talk about that because, um, Anton, you're an actor. Yeah. Shane, you're a model. Yes. What is the funniest or the weirdest thing that's ever happened to you guys now that you are out there on that platform of being sexiest men? Um, for me, uh, well, you know, I do the whole, like, I do the outro ads as yes. well, and, like, I have the spa that I go to over here in yeah. Seapoint, and the, the women that are there, it's always, like, the same, hey, Mr. Outro oh, and then, like, yeah. whenever I walk in, it would be, like, hey, when Cosmo, yeah. sexy, like, lift up, let me see. So I get, like, some chicks also, like, now and then asking me to lift up and show some body and skin. Yeah, we, we, we're actually sometimes. showing some body and skin on the screen right now. Oh, not really? not too bad, Anton, oh, not okay. too bad at all. Oh, Shane, oh, any oh, funny wait, stories you. from you? Um, oh, just the, the same thing, you know, going shopping and everybody stopping you and can we take a selfie with you yeah. and yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> now we know that Ryan Berta, Lunga Shabalala and Jonathan Boynton Lee were on the list last year. Did you guys take, secretly take any notes from them to, to make sure that you've got what it takes for this year? So, <laughs> uh, I actually, from Lunga? I have to be honest, I was, part, I was supposed to be part of last year's one and I had an injury so it was an excuse not to be part of it. But uh, John Boynton Lee was just like, have fun. Yeah. And you know, John is just the nicest guy in the world. He was just like, my friend, just have fun and do it. It's a great experience. Yo, and don't take it seriously. Yeah, I'm looking yeah. forward to my mother whooping out the calendar to her friends at church. Yay! Hey! Nice son! <laughs> Yay! Yay! This is back! Yay! <laughs> okay, so listen, Kim and I have prepared a little bit of a segment because we've heard some rumors about the three of you and we want to know if it's oh, actually dear. true She's or lying. false. Where is she? Okay, She's lying. So, um, so I've compiled this. So Shane, we heard that you are an ex you've got an extreme love for dogs and you've got a portrait of a special pup that's tattooed on your leg true or false true really yeah oh my goodness we're on your thigh uh, yeah on my thigh i'm not gonna take my pants off right now to show you, you guys come on say <laughs> Really? No, no, no. 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 <laughs> it is a family show. <laughs> um, yeah, he's my boy. He's ten years old. Love him to bits. Nice. You know, that unconditional love is just. Oh, that's awesome. Every time I see him, he's so happy. So. Oh, yeah, I know our sure. viewers are so happy because we've got your picture up from the from the calendar Ow. up on screen right now. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Anton, we heard that you have an uh, obsessive compulsive thing about brushing your teeth. You oh, do geez. it three to four times a day, as well <laughs> as washing <laughs> your hands. True yeah. or false? Uh, true. Really? Yeah. Uh, the thing is, like, you know, when your life consists of, like, castings and yeah. auditions, so you'd start the morning, you, as usual, would brush your teeth, and then you'd go out to an audition and a casting, go home, yeah. eat something, yeah. brush it again before the next casting. Okay. So you end up doing this, like, So it's more like a natural times. thing and not like a sitting and doing... Yeah, I'm not like... All day. Yeah. Okay, it's, all right. Yeah. Okay, and then lastly, um, so we found out that you are actually a member of the Kapsa Klopsa. <laughs> da 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 Is it true? To be honest, it was one of the greatest experiences ever. I was part of it, and I'm going to do it every single year. The Castle Club show was amazing. <laughs> if you get a chance, guys, jump in there, get some culture, get some color. You can keep your front teeth. 
Oh my word! No, but we've, we've got a picture of that. It was quite, it was quite epic. Now we we want to wish you guys all the best. We know that uh, we'll be finding out who the winner is on the 29th of January. We're so all winners. All the best. Yes, we are. you are all, all winners. winners. And just in case this never happens again on national TV, I just want to say myself, Anton, and Kim Engelbrecht actually grew up in the same neighbourhood. Bow for hearts, the brothers. win. So that's Salute. absolutely Salute. fantastic. Salute. Okay, cool. We've we've got um, a very amazing person on the line right now. Cat is speaking to the Premier of the Western Cape.